everyone and welcome back to my Raincode Let's Play. The last time we, well, played through the prologue, I guess. We learned, like, all about the city and our new purpose and uh, we met our new characters who aren't there yet, but they're gonna come back and um, it's an interesting bunch. That's, uh, that's for sure. I wanted to look at, at this. Oh, wait. Wait, why can I look? Oh. Wow. That's where I'm supposed to go. I see. What is new in here? Can I... Uh, can I... Oh. I see. I, why would you have to press X and not A? Wash your face. Great. Great objective. I should actually buy some stuff. Like my... Uh, you know... Uh, abilities. I was updated about that. Damn. Wow, that's a, that's a lot of text. Look at me reading all that text. Wait. Oh, you can see, you can see how you did. That's great. I mean, we already did. We all do. Do I need to read this? Probably not, right? It's fine, right? I just want to look at the whoa. At the new characters. And these guys are all dead. Why is he updated? What is updated about me? Although uh, framed by the fire village at the culprit of the amateurs massacre, you must join forces with Shinigami and expose the truth by entering the mystery labyrinth. Talent is cooking. <laughs> oh, I see our detective. Uh, our title is detective in training now. <laughs> or was it cooking? Was that before? I don't think that, so. Probably not. Uh, Shinigami, can, uh -huh. the spelling it requires reaping the souls of Kobe's soul. Okay, I guess that's all that's updated. Mm. The mystery labyrinth can be spelled by reaping the soul of the culprit from whom it was made, resulting in the culprit's death. Yako Furio. He, he dislikes death. Why do I have the feeling he is quite in death? Why are. Why is everyone so tall in this game? Holy moly. The Kanai Ward native and head of the Nocturnal Detective Agency. He lives an unhealthy, unkempt, and unsanitary lifestyle. He understands the threat of Amaterasu Corporation peacekeepers pose, but only thinks of how to avoid them. Even so, he cares a great deal for his companions. Turn a for negotiation. I mean, yeah, true. Alara Nightmare. She's also tall. Everyone's just tall. She likes cats and dogs. That's cool. She dislikes cruel con artists. I mean, yeah. A master detective dispatched by the uh, to the Nocturnal Detective Agency by the World Detective Organization. The sharp-witted and attractive detective has no specified gender. Wait, actually non-binary goals? Let's go. Tesohika Thunderbolt. Okay, he's he's small. Wait, is he shorter than uh freaking Yuma? No, he's like three centimeters taller. So sad, man. That's gotta be the hair, right? He's probably only like three centimeters taller because of the hair, right? <laughs> uh, he likes all cute girls. Wow, this likes popular guys. Wow. Master detective dispatched to the Nocturnal Detective Agency by the World Detective Organization. His goal is to become famous as a mystery-solving superstar detective. He often refers to trainee detective Yuma as a rookie. Good for him. Fubuki Clockford. She's also. <laughs> Everyone is so tall in this game. It's just. It's, it's just because I'm jealous. I also want to be tall. <laughs> Man. Uh, likes exciting adventures. Dislikes unexciting adventures. Well, a master detective is matched to the Nocturnal Detective Agency by the World Detective Organization. Although she is a beauty with outstanding style, her airheaded tendencies can frustrate the people she talks to. Yeah, I mean, I do like her character design. I mean, also like her or like their character design. Uh, and I mean his. I mean he he's kind of whatever. But yeah, she's a bit um. Well, <laughs> I mean she is just like me for real. To be fair, Vivia Twilight. He's also really tall, of course. Everyone is tall. He likes fluffy pillows. He dislikes hard pillows and living. Bro, what is your problem, man? A master detective dispatched to the Nocturnal Detective Agency by the World Detective Organization. He has pale skin and an aesthetic atmosphere about him. 
often lying down in various places, his personality can be described as self-indulgent and gloomy. Number one. We are number one. Why? Why is he? He's so short. I mean, I guess because he's old. Okay, he already shrinked. I guess. I get it. Okay. <laughs> Head of the World Detective Organization, his true name is unknown and he is almost never seen in public. He has such a villain design, he's gotta be a villain at some point, right? Like, the World Detective Organization has gotta be, like, evil near the end, right? Zulch. Uh, oh, he framed Yuma for the crime and was returning to Amaterasu when his soul was reaped by Shinigami after the mystery labyrinth was solved, resulting in his death. Damn. Wait, I should have actually read the other part. It's not... Or did I read the first part? That he was in Sesson? I don't know, man. Okay, nothing updated here. Swank. Even after the truth was revealed, he proceeded with Yuma's arrest, begging down and retreating only after Yako persuaded him. Okay. Glossary. Gotta... Gotta get rid of all that. Uh, wait, never mind. There... They actually were tutorials. Cool. Results. Okay. Thank you. You know what? I think I'm gonna get some skills. Thing is, I haven't really struggled with the reasoning death, death match. So I think I'm actually gonna focus on... On these Shinigami puzzles. And health. So give me health. Health? Wait, can't be quiet? Another skill quote. Oh. Okay. That was. Damn. Uh, sure. Give me some more vitality. Didim. Yes. Okay, in Shinigami sequences, remove one solution key. I mean, sure. And equip that. Uh, remove one solution key. Time of selectable cannot be. Yeah. I don't know if that's even good. Like, doing the Shinigami puzzle sequences slow down the rotation speed of the Shinigami barrel. Because I feel like if it's slowed down, if you, like, miss the ladder, then you're kind of screwed because it just wastes more time until you can actually, like, get the thing you want. Uh, break two incorrect letters in Shinigami. Oh, that's nice. Okay, that's actually worth it, I guess. Yeah, but don't don't equip it. I want. Do I have enough for that? I don't. Uh, never. Yeah, never mind. I do. Let's go. Okay. Very good. Very good. I don't know if I even need all that health to be honest, because I you don't really lose that much. But it's fine. Why not? Uh, wash my face, right? How about I just talk to you? If you want to wash your face, use the tap in the kitchen. D don't set me in the kitchen already, man. I'm not gonna cook for you. Okay, we already looked at everything, so. Uh, wait. Maybe I should go the right way. That would be that would be a start. There's the kitchen. Oh, that's the shower room. Wait, why am I so? Why am I going to the kitchen and not in the shower room? Wow! Even the shower is fully equipped. This submarine is incredible. Master! Why don't you go wash up first, Master? Oh, I don't need to shower right now. Come on! Jeez, way to kill the mood! Huh? What are you even talking about? <laughs> Poor you, my man. It's just... Imagine being, like, haunted by, like, a thirsty girl. I mean... I guess some people wouldn't mind, but... If you're not like, I mean, I don't know. Are you attracted to this? To this little, to, to, to this? Are you attracted to this? I can see the argument for the human form, but I'm just saying. <sighs> he said I can't work as a detective if my mind is hazy. Why do I want to become one in the first place? It's not like I have any special powers. You do. I believe in you, Yuma. You do. Is there a reason why? Even if there was, right now I have no reason to try being a detective. I'm only pretending to be one to regain my memories. 
Is it right for me to pursue this if that's my goal? Why not? Master, there you go with that dumb poetic stuff again. It's not dumb. This is important to me. <sighs> you better be careful. Whenever a detective sighs, a murder case occurs. Like it wouldn't happen otherwise? I wish that was the case. Wait a minute, Yuma. You're good at cooking, right? Can you make something for me? No, I refuse. Huh? Right now? Come on, man. I'm starving. Make it yourself. Maybe if you do some expert cooking, it might rekindle your lost memories or something. Shut it. Um, uh, I guess so. No, no, Yuma, no. Right? So get out breakfast. Thanks. Man. Wait, Chief! What should I do? You just got totally manipulated. Give it a shot. Maybe your muscles will remember. I guess I'll try. Or you can make it bad on purpose. Just to troll him. Damn, look at him go. Alright, done. Let's take it to Chief Yako. Oh, this is looking pretty good. Can I like drop it? <laughs> like whoops! I have dropped God, it. I hope Chief Yako likes my cooking. Should have like poisoned it. Or like put like um a demon stuff in there. <laughs> Can't think of the word I want to say. Chief, breakfast is ready. Hey, it smells nice. Let's see. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Nice. He's gone pale. I hope he isn't dead. No way. <laughs> Wait, you what? Did you put poison in there? Uh, Chief? Are you alright? He does not look alright. I thought I was a goner. Did you. Poison me? You would deserve that. Why would I do that? I can't believe you'd say that after all the trouble I went through making it. Right. I basically forced you to make it. Sorry. Yuma, can you clean this up? Oh, that went about as well as I expected. Master, if you ever want to boom kill someone, you should just cook for them. Damn. Good advice. I think it'd be the perfect crime. <laughs> what did my profile say I was good at cooking? Maybe like cooking as in thinking, you know? Forget about the cooking, Yuma. At least until you get your memories back. You know, as in like let him cook? Maybe that that's what they meant? He's good at cooking? Like in, in that sense? Yeah, I figured. Yesterday was such a surprise. I never thought there would be a directive from number one. To investigate Kanai Ward's ultimate secret. But it's dangerous. Amaterasu Corp won't sit idly by and let it happen. Uh, it's big trouble, all right. Look, I'm not saying I've been idle up until now. I tried investigating Amaterasu several times regarding some unsolved mysteries. They get pissed, and I get a lecture bordering on torture. They even confiscated my office. And, well, here I am now. Why didn't the World Detective Organization help you? I asked a few times, but they always waved me off. Turns out there were other cases which were higher priorities. And besides, ever since Kanai Ward became isolated from the world, we haven't been able to exchange much info. Damn. They didn't quite get how bad the place has gotten. But what made them investigate Kanai War to begin with? The Great Global Mystery must be a huge deal. Even Number One is getting involved. Hey, isn't Number One coming here? I thought he was at the WDO's headquarters. <laughs> you think I'd know? Number One is being hunted by criminal syndicates all over the world. His location is kept top secret. 
That's why he almost never shows up in public. It's super rare even to glimpse him on a screen. If he's that amazing, that's all the more reason he should come here. Yeah, fair enough. I'm sure that number one could solve this lickety split. The rumors say that once he decides to solve a case, he'll do everything perfectly on his own until it's solved. Perfectly on his own? He didn't seem all that impressive to me. True, man. Anyway, he's got his hands full on another case right now. He won't be able to leave that behind to visit Kanai Ward. We'll save our trump card for last. Until then, we'll add a few cards to our hand. That's why you all were called here. Wait, where are the others? Ah, at this rate, we'll never have enough hands. Jeez, everyone goes and does their own thing all the time. How about using a cell phone? Even if you can't contact the outside world, it'd still be useful in times like these. And no good. Risks the peacekeepers wiretapping you. Okay, Yuma, you're getting your first job. An errand. A job? Gather all the master detectives. Get the other detectives assembled. I've rented out a special room at a hotel in Kamasaki District. My guess is that they still haven't left the hotel yet. Each master detective is quirky in their own way. True. Listen, Yuma, your job is to convince them to get over here. He says it's a job, but he just made you his errand boy. Indeed, man. Fine, I'll head to their hotel. Thanks. Remember to avoid the peacekeeper's attention. <laughs> sure, hope you got all that down. You can check the next objective in the notebook menu. It'll be displayed in an icon within the district on Kan Kanai Ward map. <laughs> now that person's playing down with Rumpa 2 again. Wait. Update again. <laughs> Silent none. <laughs> <laughs> That's so sad, man. <laughs> uh, th that's perfect. Uh, wait, that was the tutorial, right? Okay, thank you. Uh, can I what, bro? Can I work map? So I'm supposed to go over here. Over there. Sun and Moon Hotel. Oh God! Oh, I remember. How I go places. Wait, what is? Wasn't that like a wait? Wait. So, um, oh, that's okay. That's just the area map. Okay, that's zooming in. Let's see. I mean, it's gonna be fine, right? You know, the question is, were we like on the water during the night? And just like surface in the morning, or where we surface the entire night? Because it would make sense if we were underwater to hide and stuff. Maybe. So your commemorative first job is an errand. Are you sure about this, Mr. Trainee Detective? No. It's better than hiding out on the sub. By the way, Shinigami, what do you know about number one? Huh? Why do you ask? I was just curious. Hmm. Wait. You know something, don't you? Very sus indeed. As if. Don't go thinking I know that geezer at all. I have standards, you know. Besides, oh, what makes you think I know any humans personally? I mean, you know Yuma personally. I mean, I'm a death god. The only people I meet are dead. Anyway, you should scope the city out while on your errand. Who knows? You might uncover Kanai Ward's ultimate secret. I don't think it's that simple. So wait, my, my theory actually confirmed. Yuma is like dead and uh, <laughs> it's just a soul possessing his body. Oh man. I don't know, man. Look at that, Master. What? What? Where? Okay, okay, I'm just going to see if there's anything like over here, but I guess not. Let's get the amazing thingy. Oh? Oh. <laughs> Obtain memory shard copper. Recall memories with stuff. 
I didn't is press A, by the way. Shinigami figurine? Why is it here? Don't worry your pretty little head about that. Stressing out about every teensy detail will make you go bald. But if you collect these figurines, you can get a peek at your memories, Master. Wait, it'll cure my amnesia? No, nope. I'm afraid everything from before you came to Kanai Ward is still off limits. Damn. Oh. What memories can I see then? Your memories with all the detectives and Buzzhead's agency. You guys talked about all sorts of stuff, right? Um, what did we talk about again? <laughs> see? You already forgot. You're completely hopeless, Master. If you want to know what you forgot about, then look for these figurines around the city. Finding them seems pretty tough, but I'll give it a shot. You can check all your recovered memories in the notebook. You know, the same place you check solution keys. I think I understand. Maybe. Right on! Thinking you maybe understand is perfect. Oh, uh, there is one thing I should warn you about. What? You won't be able to check these memories while you're unable to move around freely or in a mystery labyrinth. Okay. Got it. Shinigami's tutorial corner! Uh, memory shots that look just like me are scattered or across Kanai Ward. Collect memories memory stashed away. Correct, co collect memory shots to watch episodes featuring the other detectives under Gumshoe Gap. What is Gumshoe doing here? In the notebook menu. Yo, check, check. Search around Kanai Ward and collect all the scary cute memory shots resembling yours truly. I'm gonna try. I'm usually not that good at, like, finding, um, hidden stuff. I just want to get rid of the tutorial. <laughs> Gumshoe Gap. Master's got secret memories stashed away. In Gumshoe Gap, you can watch special episodes with each detective, but you're gonna have to find the memory shots first to unlock Here's them. A hint. If you're having trouble finding a memory shot, check out the hints. Okay, that's neat. I like the I like the hints. Gap with the echo. Wait, should I? Hmm. Sh wait, should I wait? Until I have all of them for one, or is... Oh no, wait, those are for the other ones, okay. Sure. Do it. Ruby keys accessories. Will you play the control symbols? She has a theme. Fitting to her last name. <sighs> Something wrong, Chief? What's with the big sigh? Well, it's nothing, really. Since you arrived and you began investigating Kanai Ward's ultimate secret, it seems we're all tense every day. I think it's just getting to me a bit. I can't seem to find a way to feel all nice and relaxed. Damn. I see. Damn it all. I long for the days when things were so uneventful. Before we came here, most of your work concerned infidelity and looking for lost pets, right? Yep. I used to just stare out the window and check whether the occasional client's spouse was cheating or not. I'd tail the target, and sure enough, they'd be cheating. Then the missus would end up crying when I reported back. It was the same old story every day. This may be rude of me, but that doesn't sound very fun. In fact, it sounds kind of boring. True, man. Sure is. But you know what they say. Every job is equally important. Just because a job may look more glorious, doesn't mean it's better. Nothing wrong with plain old boring jobs. What's most important is whether you can be proud of what you do. Huh, oh, look at Buzzhead trying to act all cool. Huh? What's wrong? You felt quiet out of nowhere. <laughs> it's zoned out. Nah, man, I'm I'm totally impressed. I just wasn't expecting that kind of stuff from you. I'm a bit moved. Not expecting? What's your image of me anyway? Oof, man. Sorry. But really, I'm impressed. You're right. All jobs are equally important. I'll make sure I keep that in mind. Yeah, you do that. 
When you hang around master detectives a lot, you start to think you belong to a special class of people. It's true. I hang out with them so much that I was starting to think I was on their level. I better be more careful about this. I have a saying when it comes to my own work philosophy. Nothing beats a drink after a hard day's work. I do hear that a lot. Well, it's all bogus anyway. Any time is a good time for booze. Don't drink on the job, please. A good drink is way better if you get to imbibe without having to work for it. Da, da, da. <laughs> What's wrong? You're quiet again. Are you amazed by my grown-up philosophy? I'm sorry, but I need to reconsider how impressed I was just now. Yeah. What? I can't believe you'd say that so fast. <laughs> Master Yu and Yako seem to have grown closer. Is this like a social link? <laughs> With the like, friendship points and stuff? Or was that just... Just a little cute text box? stuff i don't i don't know what, what i want to say but yeah it's funny that scene was kind of cute but like <laughs> he's acting like i've been doing this for so long like bro we haven't even started yet okay oh also no okay so these are multiple ones with the characters let's see hmm can't live without books the iron coffin bed. Star Wars in the underground world. Find the secret of the toys. Princess Kaguya in the bamboo groove. Grove. Groove. Hmm. And I'm just gonna try to look for them. The thing is, hmm. I don't know. Can you, like, go back to all the areas? Or is, is there, like, a point where you just. Master, you're not going to find the hotel up ahead. You should try looking somewhere else, That's okay? True. You're right, which way to the hotel? Well? You can I put in the light work, you can do it. Like, I don't know, can you miss stuff and like... Like, like for real miss stuff? Or can you like always go back? That's what I'm a bit concerned about. Say. Looks like every container is inscribed with the same mark. This is... It's the mark of Amaterasu Corporation. Guess that it means all of them belong to Amaterasu. What could be inside? Maybe they're full of murder cases. Full of cases? What's that supposed to mean? They mean like dead bodies? I mean, that would be a murder case. Indeed. Okay, but I guess... Oh, oh. side. There's a lot of trash here. I wonder if it gets picked up regularly. Well, Maybe they're not collecting because Fuzzhead's behind the b his bills? That's uh, very possible. Oof, man. Poor man. Getting dragged. Even when he's, like, not there. To be fair, I can't hear getting dragged because, uh... He can't hear Shinigami, so... Good for him, honestly. Good for him. Especially comfort food with the locals. I wanna try a meat bun. Love by ch children and adults alike. I wanna try. Man. Do, do. Come on, let's go! Go, go, go! Want to look for the, the secrets, though. Hello. Sorry, we're moving things in through here. Can you go around from the, over there? Yes. Yeah, sure. There's a weird TV over there. Huh. Oh, this guy is uh, a bit suspicious, but oh well. This place. Looks like a variety store. There's some questionable bottles lined up though. <laughs> hey look, there's a candy called raindrops. How crappy. <laughs> raindrops? It's funny because a friend of mine... <laughs> I'm so gonna expose her. A friend of mine who has... By the way, never played Persona 4, right? But um, she has watched like... Also not watched the anime, to be fair. She has like watched... It, only like compilations of the anime. I'm, I'm gonna watch the anime with her at one point, but like we haven't got around to it yet. And but she she has listened to some of the um, songs, and her favorite song <laughs> she told me was like, yeah, my favorite song is Raindrops. And I'm like, Raindrops? What? And I just 
couldn't figure out until like it took a bit until we figured out oh she meant like snowflakes I was, and she was like well i just misheard the lyrics and i'm like bro those are not even closely the same snowflakes and raindrops Head up the stairs. so yeah <laughs> little life trivia oh wait wasn't that the person on the train what was up with that person we don't see outsiders that much. Come on, let's hurry up. Right. Man, the city looks so cool. Um, I'll be for real. Wait, do I need to go there? I need to go over here. What is? What are these points? Are these are oh, this conversable people unavailable ascending stairs descending. Hmm. Request objective. Request. Uh, side quests, huh? Can I like go there? Or... Shinigami, stop stopping me, so I'm just gonna go here. What if there's the Shinigami figure? Also, I like the logo from the WDO. I like the cats. They're cute. Wait. Oh. Wait, can I, I can I go over there? I mean, I guess it's not locked away. Well, the question is, do do the Shinigami figures always glow like that? Like that one we found. If they do, they shouldn't be that hard to find, right? But if they don't, then that would be pretty mean. I'll probably die before I see the world beyond these tracks. Living out your whole life is in life confined in Kanai Ward is a lonely proposition, don't you think? Uh, I guess so. <laughs> of course you don't get it, Master. You came from the other side of the tracks. But I don't remember the life from the other side of the tracks. So does that really count? Oh. Okay, I can't go. Fine, I'm gonna stick to traffic laws. Man. Things I want to look at stuff because they always get points for that, and apparently to talking to people as well. So I guess I'm gonna have to talk to people. I'm sorry, even if that's boring. That's uh, what we're gonna have to do. This is what the game tells me to do. This is County Station, but trains really don't come that often. It's like this all the time. Hardly anyone comes through here, so it's required. <laughs> Since Kanai Ward's been isolated, no one's coming or going, except for you, master. <sighs> I never imagined it would be like this. Look at my points going up. This is like... This is what video games told me I should do. Points go up. <laughs> oh yeah, right, now we're in here again. How are you? The front entrance to the station is currently under construction, so please use the rear entrance. Mm -hmm. If no one's coming or going, what all the construction? Um, um, what kind of construction is being done? I hear that's going to be more important importing than exporting, so there are always expansion projects. That sounds difficult. Well, that's how much Kanai Ward is developing. Interesting. Hmm, but wouldn't that, like, be really dangerous to the amount of... Amaterasu Corporation, if like like import stuff. Oh, that's a memory shard. See, it was good going back. Memory shard. Twenty-five. Damn. Ticket gate. Uh, Looks like the ticket gate. Master. Master, look, there are a bunch of peacekeepers over by the platform. I guess they're handling security. I'd better keep our distance. So wait, who did I get my thing for? Oh, another one with Yako, huh? Hmm. I'm not sure why not. Uh, whoops. Let's do it. Now, the thing is, you can find these out of order, then, I guess, huh? Like, what if I didn't find this one, but the third one? That would be a bit awkward, wouldn't it? I'm 
back. Huh? What happened? Oh, Yuma. I'm done for. What did you do? Seriously, what happened? Well, Tetsuhiko and Halara got into a fight while gambling. You know how stubborn those two are. I tried to calm them down, but things got out of hand. I didn't know what to do. But then, Fubuki showed up. And she started shouting for them to quit fighting. She jumped right in. And things just descended into chaos. Damn. I think I get the picture. In the end, those two made up just so they wouldn't have to deal with the situation. <laughs> they all never listen to a thing I say. I'm not sure I can lead these monsters. Maybe I'm not cut out to be boss here. That's not true. You're doing great, Chief. <laughs> Me? Great? What have I done that's great? W what Well... Um... Let's see. The ability to put uh, smiles on faces. <laughs> Are you great? <laughs> This is so mean. You know, I feel like I shouldn't have watched it yet. I should have waited until I'm like at least a little bit further. Because th this like really assumes like you know the characters that well. Um, I don't know. This this also feels a bit patronizing, but I feel like this is the most positive one out of these. How do I put this? I think everyone is able to smile thanks to you. Working under your supervision keeps everybody cheerful. <laughs> so I'm nothing better than a mood setter. Yeah, I could see how you would, like, not interpret that very well, but I think that's better than just saying, anyway, you're great. If any of you bought a puppy, I'd be unemployed. Now well, he's totally sulking. Yeah. Oh, um, what else is the chief great at? Anyway, you're great! <laughs> No. What? What do you mean? I don't have the right words, but I think you're great in your own way, Chief. <laughs> Sounds a bit forced. Still, thanks. All I needed was a good laugh to feel better about everything. Well then, I'll continue being the boss for now. Looks like he finally cheered up. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, that reminds me. There's something I want to ask you. What's up? It's about my memories. At this rate, I worry I won't remember anything. So I was hoping we could make, like, a mission plan, or at least a list of things I could try, to jog my memory. Yeah, uh, I'm sorry to say, but handling stuff like that is way out of my league. No. Huh? Never mind that. Feeling down got me hungry. Hey, did you buy a meat bun for me? I hope you didn't forget the mustard. I know he's not a bad person, but still... Oof, man. Maybe he really isn't fit to be in charge. <laughs> Master, you and Yako seem to have grown even closer together. Are we sure about that? <laughs> I feel like Yuma's just losing his respect. Is that what we, like, call growing closer? Losing respect? I don't know, man. Belarus coin. Belarus takes with a Ishian coin, where lands is carefully calculated for later retrieval. Cool. Ginma district. Right there, Dragon Palace. That sounds cool, man. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, I think when I find more, I think I'm just gonna wait a bit before I like watch these. I guess. If goods can be imported and exported, then people should be able to come and go, too. Oops, please don't tell the peacekeepers what I just said. Hmm. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Okay, but at least if the Shinigami figurines are, like, all shiny and stuff, it should be, like... Like, it should be easy to find them, at least. Or, like, see them, I guess. Seeing and finding are two different things, am I right? Manto. Popular sports. Parkour. I can see that. Although... How do you do parkour when it's like raining all the time? Is that like really bad? To be fair, I've never done parkour. Because I am not athletic enough for that, but like... I... 
I would think doing parkour in the rain is pretty dangerous because then you could just slip. And if you like, I don't know, have you ever like watched like a video or something about like people doing parkour? This is like insane. They just hop over the stuff. Sometimes they're like really high up on buildings and I'm like, bruh, how do you even do that? Like without crying. <laughs> That's one stylish bench. I bet nobody sits on it because of the rain there. We know. It's a shame since you can just about see the whole city from here. Yeah, this is actually pretty cool, man. Uh, I keep saying it, but the aesthetics is just chef's kiss, man. It is, uh, it's true, man. Okay, let's go back. Kons uh, Kamasaki District, not Kansai District. Does this game run better on the OLED switch? Just curious because those load times are like pretty uh... There sure do be something. Where could it be? Wait, what could what be? What? What are you seeing? Where is she going? Oh, she's going to the hotel, I see. Now I want to talk to people first. Hey mama, buy me an... I'm a pal. How many times do I have, so, have to say no? You're not playing with your other toys. I'll take good care of it. I'll take it on walks. Do Emma pals have to be taken on walks? Um, I, I guess. Maybe. If the kid says so, then that's... That's it, right? Um. Huh? Is he dead? Um, are you okay? <laughs> It's just wrong. There wasn't some terrible accident. Too bad. <laughs> so rude, man. Mmm, garbage. Oh! All this trash is piled up and nobody's collecting it. I get it! Ah, it's the old broken window theory. A vicious cycle of littering inviting more littering. Places like this tend to be rough. So watch yourself, master at, pu uh, at puny arms. Yeah, I'll be careful. <laughs> Rankle! Do I get another skill? Sure, why not? Give me, um... Things I kind of want this to... Yep. Yep, indeed. Okay. Oh god, I'm like literally walking right in front of the peacekeeper. Hello. So let me bother you. Please don't arrest me. <laughs> oh man. I like these little guys. I have them on the wall. It's cute. Cute stuff. Hey you. Um. Dud. Just slamming at us. Let's not talk to this guy. Right. True man. That's just rude. That's just rude. Go away. Man. Nobody appreciates me being here. It's not ugly. I mean, you can barely make it out because it's way too bright, but it's not ugly, man. Might buy a raincoat. Do you not have one? Should like shouldn't you be having one if you're living here? I can go down again. Is there anything down here? Oh god, this this place is like way too big. Hey you You're a customer? Huh? Oh. Better get out of your master, he's definitely selling something dangerous. If you're not buying scram. So sorry. Damn, almost got sold drugs. Oh wait, am I on the other side? I am actually on the other side. Just a guy selling drugs. Great. What's with all these TVs, man? Master. Hey, master! Try touching the TV monitor. What? Sure, but what for? Maybe you'll get sucked inside. Hey, I was about to make that reference. There's no way that will happen. 
Like, what if we go into the TV world? <laughs> I can't believe the game made the reference for me. Such a sham. Hey! There are pipes everywhere you look in the city. I'm sure. I guess all these pipes are necessary given how much drainage is needed for the endless rain. How do you even do that, like endless rain? I know I'm going like a really stupid way, but Okay, this is yeah, that's, the hotel. Yeah, but that's where the whole hotel is. Okay, I can see how you would like hide the Shinigami figurines with all the neon lighting though. What is this? Abandoned building roof. Oh, this is where um Yako took me in the last episode. No, not the last, the, the one before that. <laughs> okay, I think we can just at least go to the general direction of the hotel. I have to go inside here, probably. I'm just over here waiting for the bus and uh, ending the part right here because uh, this is, I think, the first part that's at least close to the part time I'm aiming for, so. Um, I'm not gonna waste that and um yeah Shinigami she is uh, bored but don't mind her <laughs> anyway hope you guys enjoyed the part and um I'm gonna see you guys in the next one bye bye